the thing that we do to, to break these unhealthy cycles is really empowering um, children, but to, in order to empower the children, you have to also empower their parents. And unfortunately, most of the time that means their mothers because that's typically who is um, the, 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 the pr primary caregiver. Um, so basically showing them that there are other things that they can do with their life. In, in psychology, there's a, a certain amount of disclosure that you can share and that you can't share. But I've, I've decided in many cases to share my story because, you know, coming from a mother who had mental illness and who had substance abuse issues and all of those things, um, it really has to do with putting your mind to, to wanting something different. And no, everyone's not going to be able to take the path that I took. Um, but really knowing there's something different that you can achieve and knowing that you can break the cycles and you can have something else in life is really what's most important. So, um, and what we do with the Girl Scouts, for instance, we have a group of 10 girls every year that we take almost every week on a different adventure. Like last week we went rock climbing and the week before we went horseback riding, but just to show them there are different areas of DC to show them and to have for them to take ownership of this great city and know that this is yours and you're not limited by anything um, that people tell you and you're not limited by that body of water that separates Southeast from the rest of the city. Um, so those are the success stories when I, I see my girls and they're able um, to say, oh, I've done this, this, and this, and I want to, to be this when I grow up because we expose them to different women who have achieved.